So guys, there's going to be two links down below to download isdon.duo and to download onoc.duo. You want to download both these duo files. So for the first one, isdon.duo, we're going to scroll down. You want to get the first one that comes up, click on download. It's now going to start downloading in 5 seconds, wait for this to load. And now it should have started downloading. Now for the second one, onoc.duo, we're going to scroll down. You want to get the first one that comes up, you want to click on download. Wait for this to load. And we'll now have both of these downloaded. By the way, if the download did not start, then you want to click on download right here for both of them. And now that we have them both downloaded, for the second step, you want to head over to search and type in File Explorer. Click on it. And then once you're on this, on the left hand side, you want to click on downloads. And then once we're here, we should be having both these zip files right here. So we're going to extract both of them. So for the first one, you just want to right click on it and then click on extract all. And you can untick this and then click on extract. Now for the second one, right click on it. Extract all, and then click on extract. And we're now going to have both these folders. You can just delete these ones right here. And now I'm just going to double click on this one till I find the DL file. You just want to move this to your desktop. And now for the second one as well, go back to the download folder. Do it for the other one. Find the DL file, move that to your desktop. And now that we have both of these, we're now going to copy both of them. So you just want to highlight over this, right click, and then copy. Just copy both of them. And then once you copy that, for the next step, you're going to head over to search again and type in Fud Explorer. Click on it. And then once you're on this, on the left-hand side, you're going to scroll down and then click on this PC. And now you're going to find the drive with the Windows logo on it. Double click on it. And then click on Windows. We're now going to scroll down till we find System32. Here it is, System32. Double click on this folder. Now you want to paste what you just copied right now into System32. So just right click and then click on Paste. And then click on Use Full Current Items and then continue. Paste both these DL files into this folder. And then once you've done that, you now want to go back to the Windows folder. Now we're going to scroll down a bit more till we find Syswell64. Double click on this and then do the same thing. Right click, paste, do this Full Current Items and then continue. Which will now paste both these DL files into these folders. And now for the next step, you're going to head over to the link, which will be down below in the description. To download Microsoft Visual C++, we're going to scroll down. We have two downloads here, 64 and 86. To know which one you need, you're going to head over to search and type in system information. Click on it. And then once you're on this, next system type is going to be telling you, I'm on x64, so I'm going to be getting that download. You are also most likely going to be on x64 like me. However, if your one says x86 or x32, then you want to get the other one. In my case, it says x64. So I'm going to begin this one, x64. Wait for this to load. And we're now going to click on the download. And then once this comes up, you're going to tick this. And then click on install. And then click on yes. Wait for this to load. If you get this, you're going to click on yes again. Wait for this to load. And now it should be saying setup successful. We can now close out of this. And now for the last step, you just want to restart your computer. And then the problem should be fixed. 